Speaking to a Liberty Sports News crew, ex Super Eagles midfield Trojan Gaba Lawa expressed fears with regards to Nigeria's chances of qualifying for the next FIFA 2022 World Cup holding in Qatar. It's worrisome at the moment. We are not, um, we, 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 our players are not, um, our fans are not impressed with the way we play. But football sometimes is like that, it's very difficult. But, um, but I believe um, that final game in March. It's, um, it's very decisive and very dicey. I believe um, those players know the importance of going to work up. Lawa said it was sad that the current crop of local players and some foreign stars lacked the killer instinct of their time and called for more commitment from the players whenever they adorned the green-white-green green jersey of Nigeria. Yeah, the expectation to see, um, to see our players excelling week in, week out. And the most important thing also is the funding. Without funding, you can't you can run a league. But I hope... Um, the LMC, you know, the ministry, minister himself, everybody can join hand and, and, and be solid to, to, to become one. Another ex-international Tijani Babangida said fears over Nigeria's qualification isn't out of place, but believes the Nigerian spirit will carry the team over the line. He praised his former team Ajax and Nigerian players in foreign leagues for their quest for success, as other sports journalists, pundits and fans bear their mind. Whenever Nigeria are pushed to the wall, they always come out. It's not going to be easy because uh, there are some few games that uh, we are not happy with what we saw, but we still win. Uh, I believe if we can still win and be playing like that, I like winning. If the team can still win and didn't play well, but uh, we want them to play well and, and win. Honorable Sonny Dari is so passionate about infrastructure. And when he came into office, the first thing he said is, we're going to put those infrastructures that, that has to do with, um, that is being owned by the federal government back into Please, and that is exactly what we witnessed today. I feel so elated. I feel so excited that today I can I can watch a, a, a football match at the Moshid Abiola Stadium. Sports lovers in the country, especially football fans, are in vast debate on the likely consequences of the recent sacking of the nation's XY German coach Genaro at the brink of the 2022 World Cup qualifiers holding in March 2022. Anthony Momodu, Liberty News.